<laughs> Finally, you score a point against me on the ground. You have improved, Ingrid. That was nothing more than a fluke. My technique was horribly sloppy that last round. It does not matter what sort of technique it was. You won. If this had been a real battle, I would be dead. You wielded your lance well, without any hesitation. Has your approach changed? You may recall when I said I'm now able to move on, because of you. I remember. What did you mean by it? That I finally understand a truth about Glenn. It sounds as though he died with a heavy heart. A heart that carried regret. I had suspected as much. But instead of acknowledging it, I twisted my memory of him to fit an ideal I've been upholding. I see. Your Highness, I will not sacrifice my life for anyone. But perhaps instead, I can live my life for someone. I will pledge my life to you. And... How exactly am I meant to interpret that? However you please, your highness. <laughs> oh? Well then. Ingrid, when this is all over, I want you to... Um... To support and defend me. As my knight. I have been thinking of telling you this for a long time. We get along well, you and I. As your knight? Yes, yes, of course. Of course I will. I intended to do so for your... For the sake of the kingdom. Together, your highness. You and I. Our first order of business. Putting this tragic war to an end. Yes. And while we're at it... Do not die on me, Ingrid. Promise me that. Yes, your highness. I swear it on my lance. <laughs>